Hi, I'm Yu Chen Zhang from Macquarie University and Wuhan University. In this video, I'm going to introduce our work, Heterogeneous Subgraph Transformer for Fake News Detection. With more and more people jumping onto social media and getting their news online, the rise of fake news is causing a real headache. It turns out that over 60% of Australian social media users are feeling unsure about what is real or fake on the internet. Researchers have made many progress in fighting fake news. However, traditional content-based methods fall short in distinguishing well-crafted fake news. While most graph-based methods depend on additional social structures, in light of the fact that fake news fabricates irregular relations among loosely related entities and topics, and their semantics deviates from the genuine, we are interested in exploring such interlocal structures and new semantics and reformulate fake news detection as classifying the heterogeneous subgraph centered on each news article. In the example provided, the subgraph rooted in the fake news comprise the really related entities 5G and COVID-19, along with the topic spread of COVID-19. In our research, we introduced hetero SGT to address challenges in learning textual features and classify heterogeneous subgraphs. We start by extracting entities and topics from news articles and utilize a pre-trained language model to obtain their embeddings. A heterogeneous subgraph is then constructed to model the relations among news entities and topics. Subsequently, we use a random walk with restart to extract subgraphs centered on each news article. The proposed Hitler SGT takes a random walk sequence as input and generates a subgraph representation to train the classifier with observed labels for detecting fake news. It should be noted that, to the best of our knowledge, Hitler SGT is the first attempt to explore both word and sentence level semantics, as well as the structure information among news, entities, and topics for fake news detection and by assigning a relative positional encoding to each node according to its position in a random walk sequence, Hitler SDT mitigates the problem of learning node positional encoding in graph transformers. Through the, expense, through the extensive experiments on five real-world datasets, we demonstrate the superior performance of Hitler SDT. Thank you.